After making it to the national championship game last season, there are very high expectations for the Fighting Irish women's basketball team this year. Expectations that the players clearly embrace, as we found out at today's Notre Dame Basketball Media Day. You know, we love the pressure and the attention, and, you know, we had a great season last year, but we obviously didn't accomplish what we wanted. We wanted a national championship, and it just makes us work that much harder and, you know, prove a lot of people wrong. You know, we have a lot of work still. You know, it's early in the season. We're trying to work out our kinks still. We have a couple new freshmen coming in, and we just kind of got to get back into Irish basketball and just kind of remembering how all of us play together. And it's going to take a little bit, but I think we're all ready. I think it gives us an extra focus, you know, to be that close, to know what it took to get there and be that close and not get it. It's, it just gives you a whole nother drive for the year, just to know what you're capable of. It wasn't, it's a lot of what ifs, what ifs, you know, but at the same time, you know what you can have to do to fix it because we were just a few minutes away, you know. It's the fact that we didn't win it last year, I think, is enough drive for to know that people are going to come at, at us, obviously. Um, it's going to be tough, but I think we'll be able to handle it just because we didn't win. So, I mean, while we have a target on our backs, we're, we're still focused on one thing, too. And so we're going to have to take it game by game and know that everybody's going to come for us. But I think it's a challenge we'll be able to handle. You know, to be honest, after the summer, we were able to, or, you know, during the summer, we were able to use, we'd shout out 15-52, which was one of the, in the second half, where we were up seven and we lost um, the game pretty much from there. From there, it was um, kind of obvious, sort of a downhill battle. And then this summer, we've just been motivated to just keep our success um, last year and rolling it into just kind of avoiding off um, avoiding off last year's success and moving on to a new new year we've got new people we've got we lost a crucial senior but you know moving into this year we've been able to prepare um, in a different way and um, a lot more and better for it well I just have to be myself I mean I got to this point by being myself um, and you know you can't change who you are and you know when when we step on the court all peripheral things go out the window um, and at the same time understanding that it, it's, it's not about me you know what I mean it's, it's about this team and the focus will be on this team um, you know at all times so um, regardless of any individual accolades I mean that's amazing it's a blessing I'm honored um, but at the same time I'd much rather a national championship than player of the year well, we got a lot of good players on this team, and I think I don't know why people don't understand that by now. I mean, we got two All Americans, and you know, all tournament team, Devro Peters, one of the hardest matchups in the country, Natalie Novosel, and then you got Kayla McBride returning, whose sense of urgency is the greatest on this team right about now, as far as her just ready to get back on the court. And then you got Natalie Achano, who's ready to step up and be a, a big, you know, you saw a little bit of her at the end of the season, um, but I think this year her confidence is at all time high and we have a lot of good players so as far as you know what I do um, I'm gonna continue to do what I do and they stop me they got to stop the rest of the team because I have no problem in getting 12 assists a game <laughs> the Fighting Irish will take to this Purcell Pavilion court for the first time on November 2nd when they take on Windsor in an exhibition game at 7 p.m. A game you can watch live right here on UND.com. At Purcell Pavilion, I'm Jack Nolan, UND.com.